Yo, what is up, guys? We got the Shrine and Secrets today. And uh, I'm going to do Survivor first. So for Survivor, we got uh, Windows of Opportunity and we got D Diversion. So basically what Windows of Opportunity does is uh, it allows you to see every uh, pallet, every window vault, basically around the whole map within 20 meters of wherever you are on the map. So, <clears throat> I mean, it's, it's, it's a pretty good perk for those that are like more so newer to the game and don't know where things are like pallets and loops and stuff like that so i would say it's pretty good for the most part but like i would say more so for those that don't know the maps that well so yeah but i mean overall it is it is still a good perk because maybe if you have teammates that just like to throw pallets and stuff you'll know okay there's nothing over there so maybe i gotta go over here or maybe i could look over here i should say so um yeah that's windows of opportunity then we got a uh, diversion. So basically, <clears throat> in order for this to work for in, for any like for stars, anyways, is um you would need the killer to basically be within your be within the tear radius of you, or like you would have to be within the killer's tear radius for this to even activate because it takes like uh shoot like 30 seconds maybe to activate, and then basically uh you throw the rock and you throw the rock anywhere and basically it gives the killer a notification as if somebody's in that area some killers fall for it most killers don't uh but you know it's a pretty good perk i guess you could say for the most part especially if you're trolling or something but i'd say for late game it'd be it's a really good perk like say you're the last one alive and the killer's near the door or something maybe you could throw it and you know throw the killer off and something i don't know but uh yeah so that's uh, diversion, but I'm gonna throw this into a build. I'm gonna get straight into a game. So yeah. All right, all right, all right. <clears throat> so uh, here we got uh, windows of opportunity. This is it. You basically can see everything. You can see all the pallets, all the windows, and this is all within. Uh, Oh man, I think 28 meters. I don't even remember what tier 3 is for max range, but basically you can see everything. You can see all the windows, pallets. Yeah, that's, that's basically windows of opportunity. I'm facing a Bubba. I thought that was a Death Slinger. I was trying to think in my head real quick of who that was, but I couldn't tell. I was like, huh, who is that? Okay. Bubba, don't chase me, man. Let me live. I'm gonna vault? Yeah. Oh my god, he has bamboozled. That was a perfect pallet job. Wow. I don't think his uh, ruins on tier 3. Did he leave chase with me? Well, we'll keep in mind that he has rune on tier three. Oh wow, he didn't come for me. Wow, I would have been smart for him to come for me because I kind of like ran around the the mountain or whatever, which was bad. Nice, we're about to get into chase. Sheesh. Oh yeah, this is where we die. Never mind. Okay, he has no enduring. I might dumb tech him for the fun of it. I just feel like having fun this game. But we, we do have Discord, so we can make a play with it. I'm gonna go ahead and drop that real quick before I even try anything, because, uh, yeah. Is this window right here? This is not a window. We got this window, though. He's gonna M1 me, maybe? Oh, no, he's not even close enough. Okay, never mind. Yeah. I'm so happy we got a fastball right there. I could probably loop this twice, maybe. Never mind. I'm gonna go around this whole long way. Yeah. Wait, did I drop? Yeah, I did. I did. I did. Okay. I'm 
I'm gonna have to drop this. Just I hate facing a bubble because like I, I just get forced to drop so much stuff. Oh, he's leaving Chase. Nice. Oh no, he's not. Okay. Or maybe he's going to kick the pallet. Or Jen, sorry. Oh, that girl's dead on her. I had no clue she was over here. I heard it last second, but I didn't see her. Did she have DS or did it run out? Has it been a minute? Yeah. Can I finish this in time, at least? Yes, sir. I don't even know if there's a gen uh, pallet over here. I might be dead. Yeah, it got used up. Ooh. Bro, he was revving his chainsaw and then stopped. Why? I, I, I only jumped in that locker because I thought he was going to rev, rev his chainsaw. But I guess not. I should have looked back, but I didn't because I just I heard his chainsaw and immediately thought I'm going to go into his locker because why not? Actually, no, no, no. I can heal myself. You're good. Do that, Jim. Bruh. bruh. <laughs> Let's get on the gen. We need to get this last gen done anyways. Okay. Here, I'll try to make a play right now. Maybe. If possible. Okay. Uh, He's probably going to pick that girl up. So let's do this. Let's throw that over there. Okay. Well, it, 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 okay. 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 That, was, <laughs> that, <laughs> that was a terrible representation of Divergent. I, I will be honest. I will be honest. That was, <laughs> that was pretty trash. That was pretty trash. I mean, but like, I thought I can help her, help her by like, you know, distracting him to go somewhere else, and she killed herself. I was gonna like go all the way around, but I guess not. I'm gonna hope that girl's almost done with her gen, cause uh, yeah. All right, we got diversion again. I want to take his attention so she can finish her gen. Not gonna lie, but he's probably gonna make his way over there right now. Anyways. Yeah, her gen was so close. I could try to finish it for her, but I don't even know. Hopefully she has adrenaline when she gets hit. I had a feeling she was done, because she was sitting over here for a while, so... Yeah. Okay, well, at least I finished her gen for her. I can't save her. I can't save her. I can't save her. I wanted to like maybe run around behind him and then like, you know, I, I just couldn't save her. But I mean, diversion is a funny perk, you know, it it's kind of hard to get use out of it. Like, well, it's not hard, but it's kind of like, it all depends on whether the killer even falls for it or not. So I really couldn't show diversion, but technically I did showcase it. But I mean, Basically, you're just throwing a rock, and if the killer chooses to go to that area, then they choose to go to that area. There's not a high chance that they will go, especially at my ring, because it's like... I mean, maybe they would. Depends what kind of situation you're in, but, you know, you never know. Also, uh, I do shrines every week, so if you want to see me do shrines for a killer and survivor, uh, feel free to subscribe and turn on post notifications. Uh, today, I only posted survivor. Tomorrow, I will be posting the killer. So, um... Yeah, and I'm pretty sure what's in the shrine for the killer is, uh, Devourer, no, 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 it's, um, oh man, I forgot what it's called. It's that, that one perk that's a one hit when they cleanse a totem and, uh, something else, I forgot. But, uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, feel free to subscribe and turn on post notifications since I do shrines every single week for both killer and survivor. But, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed and peace.